guys. Well, I am so excited. Angie's joining me as well. Jay's going to be here in just a second. But you're looking at truly a once in a lifetime moment. And I know that sounds dramatic, but it is dramatic. This is a really, really big deal. And I'm so excited to be the host because I love jewelry. I have since I was a little girl. The passion for jewelry came from my mom and father. Uh, I love talking about jewelry. I had the GIA certifications, all that fancy stuff. And it all boils down to one moment, one night, and one beautiful choice of necklaces. Why is it once in a lifetime? Because this is so rare. It's so highly unusual. Jay will never be able to do it again. And we're talking about some of the very best, the finest, the rarest Ethiopian opals. Now here's what's even more interesting. I have two choices and I'm actually going to set both of these together so you guys can see them and you want to get started early on these two because I have so much to tell you. Again, we're talking about the most delightful opals, the most captivating, the ones that people ooh and awe about, the ones that truly are heirloom collectors and look at that fire, look at the brilliance, look at the rainbow, those mini rainbows of color. Each and every bead, Jay promises, will look just like that all the way around the entire necklace. Your first choice on the top, we're calling it honey. Uh, it's also called lion's mane. It's that beautiful, warm honey tone. The one down below, which is, I think is really fascinating, is called silver frost. But right there in that amazing shot from Mark, my director, you can see how exciting this truly is. And I will tell you, this value is unbelievable unprecedented, absolutely unprecedented, because we've never done anything like this. We've done something close to this. We've offered an Ethiopian opal, just kind of the honey color, not this level of quality, but certainly a beautiful opal. And it's sold out probably three times over the last two years. And I've presented it a couple times, even picked it as one of my favorites online from Jay. But tonight we go to a whole new level. And there's one last thing before I bring Jay on that I want to share with you. And this is the most remarkable to me. So I was getting ready for the show and whenever we do a Today Special, and I'm blessed to launch a lot of these, you know, we're talking, oh my gosh, if it's uh, Diane Gilman jeans, we're bringing in 50,000 pairs. You know, most TSs or Today Specials, there'll be thousands and thousands available for the day. Listen to this. In both of my choices, that stunning, cool, frosted silver or the honey, I have less than a thousand each for the entire day. In fact, this is so rare. I don't have bracelets. I don't have a ring. We were even laughing saying, oh, it's too bad Jay couldn't have done a little pair of earrings. This is so rare and there's so little of it. He could not do any matching pieces. And that's just the beginning of a very exciting story. We're going to be busy all hour. This is a great launch and I'm so excited you're with me. Certainly make that choice as early as you can because quite frankly, I'm shocked. We have so few to go around and clearly this is expected to sell out very early today. All right, well, here he is, Jay King. He's been here for more than oh, 25 years, actually 27 years, doing this for 41 years, Jay. And again, you've completely outdone yourself. What is your feeling about this today's special? Why are you so excited about it? Okay, guys, <laughs> this is... Honestly, okay, the opportunity of a lifetime. I've been sitting on these for four years. I, I've had these for four years. I want to tell you how crazy this is. This is, I, I will never be able to do this again. I can't even believe that we're doing it now. If you went, if you went to the Tucson Gym and Mineral Show, the largest event of its type in the world, in the world, if you could find one of these necklaces, if you could find with, and here's the thing, no matter how, no matter what we show them here on the shots, and we've got some fabulous shots uh, on these, right? You see the fire. I guarantee you when you open the box, it will look better than what you're seeing. And that looks pretty good, right? I mean, do you see the fire? This is, this is AA grade Ethiopian precious opal. We've saved these. I've sat on them for four years. To, we, we bought this directly from the mine. They, we, we made a deal. I've been selling off the small lots, and people have been buying it. You've never seen these two colors, and you've never seen these size. This is the last of the faceted material that I have. I'll never be able to do this. In 27 years of doing today's special, this is number one. I, I've never had any Today Special that even came close to this. In 45 years of doing this in my lifetime, this is 
the ultimate thing I've ever, ever been able to do. And that says a lot. Okay, I'm just telling you, don't miss out on these. When they're gone, they're gone. This isn't something I can repeat on. It's not something I can, I, I'm going to be able to get more. And here's what makes them so crazy. Every single bead, I guarantee you get this home. When you open the box, there will not be one single bead that is not on fire. And that's what makes this so special. This was a crazy, crazy deal. I've, I've set on them, like I said, I've set on these. I knew I was going to do this today special. We were saving it for October. There were so many years when I needed a today special that I had these and I almost brought them, but we thought, no, we're going to wait. We're going to wait. <laughs> now we've sold all the other faceted material that we have. Yes. I have no more to show. We saved these till the last. You can't go. If you went to Tucson and you went, and this is a wholesale show, it's not retail. I'm not talking retail. I'm talking wholesale. Right. You couldn't buy one of these strands. You could not buy one for what we're selling this today. You can't buy them. You couldn't find them. Even if you even if you find it, you might have like every third bead have fire, right? right, right. Or every second bead would have fire. I guarantee you every one of these has immaculate fire. Look. This is precious opal. <laughs> Wait, hang, it, hang on, Jay, one second. It's an unbelievable value. Let me show you. I'm going to go down to the little stuff. Now, these are really big uh, beads, by the way, really big, and they're all faceted. Now, look, we're going to go to the smallest one on there, R right here. This is all sterling silver right at there. But look at this one, and look at this guy. And when Jay said every single opal will have this amazing, amazing, miniature, flashing, brilliant rainbow of colors, he isn't kidding. So that's the smallest guy in the back, and then I'm going to take you all the way around. I'm going to, we're going to see the whole thing. And look at every single bead is sensational. Every single bead has just unbelievable. In fact, I'll go all the way to the other side. I want you guys to really see what he's talking about. There's not a dead bead. There's not a dead spot. Uh, and they call it dead spots when you're talking about opals. And here's the story about an opal in general. In opals, color is everything. Color is everything. And you, the more colorful it is, the more of that brilliant natural sparkle of that rainbow, the more valuable it is, the rarer they are. That's why most people, when they see opals, they go, oh, I've never, seen, you know, oh, it's October birthstone. I got this cloudy little opal necklace. And you think, oh, that's a great thing. No, the more color, the rarer, the more valuable they are. And you can see it right there. There is nothing we've ever had on the air. And I've been blessed to work at two different networks. I've been talking about jewelry for more than 20 some years. Yeah, Yes, I've got the whole GIA certifications, all the fancy stuff when it comes to gemstones. And I have never, as a host who's done this a long, long time, have seen anything more brilliant and opal than this. And this is the family heirloom. This is the treat. This is something that you deserve. This is something that is a, it is, it is a once in a lifetime. And for me as a host, to be able to even talk to you about it, to wear this, to actually own this, I understand the rarity of it and how brilliant and unusual this is. Now, just from our perspective, the comparable retail value is $900, baloney. <laughs> I mean, that we're, we're very fair and we're very conservative. So we, we say 900 and that's fair and very conservative. Our price is 879 for literally one day. And it's not at this rate and at this clip and at this pace. It will not last all day long. It, it can't possibly last all day long. We have less than 800 in each choice. And they're running pretty even, which I find very interesting. You're picking, do you want this stunning warm honey or do you want the beautiful, I love the silver frost. First time we're showing both of these. And if you've ever wanted really the epitome of getting an opal and you want a full 18 inch necklace with the two and three quarter inch extender, now is your moment and now is the time truly. And I love midnight because I've got them both and I've got enough of them for the moment that might not be true at the end of the month. As I just mentioned too, by the way, October, this is your birthstone. So if you're an October birthday baby or maybe you really messed up and you didn't get your October birthday a baby something really nice, this would be absolutely the highlight. This is one of those lifetime moments, those lifetime opportunities where you go, oh my gosh, I can own an exquisite Ethiopian opal necklace. And if you're a person who loves exquisite, you love to treat yourself, you love the unusual, you want the rare, you want the ones that truly are the brilliant and vibrant, the ones that are only a handful that you could ever get in the world, this is 
is your necklace. And Jay, I do love that because I know you you are as you were so excited about this one. And you said to me, and I actually wrote it down as a quote from you. You said in the 27 years of Mind Finds here in HSN, and then you said in the 40 some years you've been talking about gemstones, you've never been more excited about a today's special or a necklace or a piece of jewelry than this. And why is that? Okay. <laughs> this is, like I said, I sat on these for four years. Right. I want everybody to understand, okay, this is the greatest thing that I've ever done in 45 years. It, it was the most amazing deal that I've ever done in my entire career. The, this is... You know, even ignore, okay, I want you to do is ignore the comparison price. I'm telling you personally, if you go to the Tucson Gem Show, you can't find this. You couldn't buy this wholesale for that price. They, there would be a lot more, and I'm not even going to say thousands. I will tell you, I, I've shown, okay, I've shown a few of these um, to friends of mine uh, that are in the jewelry business uh, that sell high end. Okay, I'm talking like, all diamonds, emeralds, high end. This is the rough material that this is cut from. This isn't the lion's mane, this is the frost material right here. Look at the fire. Okay, this is Ethiopian precious opal. Every single bead, no matter what we're showing you here, I, I guarantee you this a thousand percent. I guarantee you a thousand percent. You get this home, you open the box, and then you're gonna go, it did it looks 100% better than it did on air, and it looks good. We have worked so hard to get lighting. This is studio and lighting. Lou, uh, everybody at the studio there with Suzanne, everybody has worked so hard to try to show this material. I am telling you, it is on fire. This is Ethiopian precious opal. Every single bead, though, and this is the key thing, every single bead. I've, I've had precious opal in the past, but... Here's the thing, every single solitary bead will be on fire. It has fire. Um, you'll never get an opportunity like this. When these are gone, they're, they're just gone. I could never do this again. Even if, even if I could bring this back, even if I could bring it back, the, you know, if I bought this on a normal, on a normal deal, I'd be selling this for two, three thousand dollars. I mean, these things, it's just, you just don't get it. Um, I, <laughs> I, I kept waiting on these. We kept it. We had smaller lots when we did this deal. We had smaller lots. Every bit of that is now gone. Everybody saw that. They were all different shapes, different sizes, different things. And we moved all the small lots. We wanted to do that before we did this. These were the two that, I, that made the deal really the sweetest deal. This size on this, the faceting on it, the craftsmanship on this is just amazing. The color is unbelievable. But if, you, if you're gonna buy one thing, and, and I know this is, you know, it, it, it seems like it's expensive. And I know, you know, money, you know, is tight. I, and I always tell everybody, don't get yourself in any trouble. I mean, do, but this is something that really is something that you can hand down for the rest of your life. There's not a single person that you're gonna show this to or wear this that is gonna know, if they, if they, if they don't, not a mind find customer, they're not gonna think that you paid this price for this. You can't see it, you take it, I guarantee, you, take it into any jeweler, I'll give you that. Take it to a jeweler, show it to them, and this is the real deal. This is natural, Ethiopian precious opal. We've got two colors, the, the, they're calling the honey, they call that in the industry, they call it lion's mane, is what it's known for. And then you've got the other, which we're calling the silver frost. This, that's more normally what the precious opal would uh, look like. Right. To Suzanne's point, okay, we, um, okay, uh, you know, I'm, I'm gonna tell you guys something now. <laughs> so the rough material, we were able to do this deal, yes. which is like a ridiculous, <laughs> crazy, so stupid deal. Right. I mean, I, I mean, you'll never, I'll ne I'll, this will never ever happen again in my lifetime. Okay, right. I can't still believe every time I see this, I can't believe that we did the deal that we, we were able to get. If I would have done a pair of earrings, okay, we were, we were gonna take our rough and cut a pair of earrings. A pair of earrings would have been a, like a six by eight oval 
would have been right around three hundred dollars. Oh okay, my gosh! So we were thinking we can't we can't do that and so the necklace. That's why I didn't do any accessories. I'm telling you, this material <laughs> wait, wait, Jay, is over we're like, the top. Can we at least put a little earring on or something? He's no. like, no. He goes, literally, I cannot make anything more than we did. Hey, Jay, I did have given give an update because I find this really so exciting. I am such a jewelry nerd. I literally, I have goosebumps. I'm just it's so it's so wonderful to see something so rare and it's so wonderful to be able to talk about it with you uh, and it's so wonderful to have this moment because for those of us who see a lot of jewelry it can kind of become a little repetitive when you're doing a lot of jewelry shows over 20 some years and then you have a moment like this where you have something that's so precious and so amazing um, what a lot of people think when they see this and th this is how good this is they think oh that's got to be a synthetic like because you never ever see this kind of brilliance, glow, fire, rainbow out there at the stores or even at beautiful, beautiful jewelry shops or stores or whatever. You never see it because, oh, that's a synthetic. No, 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 guys. This is absolutely 100% genuine. You have to understand this. This is the real thing. People are like, oh my gosh, how can it be that price if it's real and it's precious Ethiopian opal? Well, it's just because of Jay. He's held it off for four years. He always gives us spectacular savings and great offers. And what we did, because I do want to share this with you, especially if you're new, you might be saying, oh yeah, this, this, I really would love to have this. I love our flex pan. I want to explain that to a lot of you. Down here below, you'll see we have what's called five flex pay on this, which means use any major credit card card and you're going to spread your payments out over five months. It is not layaway. Okay. You're going to get it right away. We have these in stock. No worry about that. You will get this, but you have five months to pay it off. Now, if you're going to share it as a gift with someone, which would be an amazing gift, I would be very happy to have this under the tree or in my stocking or wherever. Um, you have until the end of of January to love it, or I say to leave it at the mailbox. You can return it and still get a refund. If you wanna get this at home and you're like, I can't believe this, I've gotta see it in person. It's okay, wear it for three and a half months. And again, if you don't get compliments, if you're not absolutely, completely blown away and mesmerized by this, I please send it back. I want you to send it back and I want you to get your refund, but I want you to see it in person. It has a glow. This is what gets people like me excited. The glow is absolutely phenomenal. Those wonderful silica spe spheres, that's what creates the rainbow in nature's rainbow in an opal. They're absolutely brilliant. The vibrancy, the flashing, the array of colors. And again, in opals, color is everything. That's why when you normally buy basic old cloudy white opals, you're like, well, that's all I've ever seen. Now you're seeing something that is so extraordinary and so different. Now, here's what's very interesting, though. If you want the silver frost, right now, that is the most popular of the two. So if you're going, but not by much, it's, it's virtually a dead heat, really. But if you want the silver frost, that is the most popular. And please understand, what I said earlier is we brought in only about 1,200 each for the entire day. Guys, when we do today's specials, they're like, 20,000. Even with Jay, we'll do 12,000, 15,000, 10,000. This is the smallest today special that Jay has ever done. The smallest in terms of quantity. And also, you guys are asking the size of the beautiful faceted beads. They're five by two millimeter and nine by five millimeter. So they're really quite substantial. And, and that, Jay, is very, very surprising. And they gradually get bigger as you go down to the front. So the very largest of the beads are going to be obviously the ones right smack in the front. And it's so crazy. When I look down on these guys, the, the glow, the 360 degree experience of looking at these is really just, it's, 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 I'm almost with, you know, I almost don't have words for it. You, and you'll see it when you get it home. Gosh, when you lift it out of the box, or even when you open that box for the first time, you're absolutely going to be blown away. I promise you've never seen an opal as exquisite as this is. I really, truly do. All right, Jay, I know you have more to share with us, so I'd love you to continue on. I just want to give everybody an update of kind of where we stand on these. Okay, look, I, I, and I'm telling you, the big thing with this <laughs> We're showing them here, and they, they actually are showing better than they normally, uh, when we show precious opal. Stage lighting's not the best thing. We've really worked on this. As good as they look here, it's nothing compared to when you open the box, what they're gonna look at. I'm looking at it right now on both of these, 
And I guarantee you what we're showing, what the, the camera's showing you is not what you're, it, you're really going to see. Okay, this is amazing. And here's the thing. Every single bead in this will have fire. That's the main thing. Take the challenge on this. I guarantee you, I dare you, take it to any jewelry store. Take it to any legitimate jewelry store that's selling diamonds, that's selling, you know, uh, 22 karat gold, people that are doing super high end. Show them this and then don't tell them what you paid for it. And then when you tell them what you're paid for, they're just going to go that they, they could never even come close to this. I, let me tell you, so I have connections I'm, and we're dealing directly with the mine here. OK, I have unbelievable connections. I could not. Honestly, I couldn't go do this deal D doing directly with the mine. I did this with a mine owner. This is what we called an opportunity of a lifetime buy. OK where we worked with a mine owner. It was just one of those things. I still pinch myself. We did this deal. Like I said, every one that we've done, we had small lots. We had like 80 of this. We had 60. We have 100. You can, to even get the, uh, to get 1,200 of each of these colors in this size, do you know how crazy that is to be able to do that? how much material that takes of all the triple A, double A, A grade, the really super high, high grade material. You just can't do it. And when you do, they won't, I couldn't bring this on. Even if I went and tried to do a deal, I might be able to get, luck. maybe if I was really fortunate, maybe 20 or 30 of these, they would have to be at least three times, four times the price, maybe even higher. To, to be able to get it. I'm telling you, if you even go to Tucson and look at what they sell strands that aren't even this nice for in this size, you couldn't even buy them wholesale. This is truly the opportunity of your lifetime with me anyway. I've never had anything like this. I've never had anything better. And Jay, you know what? I want to make sure everybody understands. These are genuine. These are the real thing because Jay, some people are like, it's it's too good, it's too beautiful, it's too spark, it's too rainbow, it's too colorful. It's absolutely genuine. This is absolutely genuine Ethiopian precious opals. So please don't forget about that because I think that's one of the key factors here. This isn't synthetic, guys. Absolutely it is not. Because most people only have seen this kind of color in synthetic fakes. This is not. All right, got a lot coming up on hsn.com, by the way. Check it out. We always have the most amazing deals. And we have thousands of products on hsn.com that we never ever actually get on the air. For example, we have baby clothes. We have things like really great, crazy NFL stuff and so much more. Hey, by the way, coming up, I have an item that sold out last time I was on with Jay a year and a half ago. They say home is where the heart is. So when I'm at home, I want it to feel warm and welcoming and full of things that make me smile and make life just a little bit easier. So join me every Tuesday for your weekly look at the latest ways to make your home a haven. Want to be the best gift giver this season? It couldn't be easier at the hsn.com gift store, where you can find thousands of gifts for everyone on your list. Just search by person, price, category, or even by interest, and we'll take care of the rest. Discover our holiday gift guides and get inspired by our festive tips and tricks videos. You'll never run out of ideas at the gift store. Search gifts at hsn.com. Make this holiday more festive than ever. Get back to tradition or start brand new ones. Deck every hall and wall. Cook exceptional meals. Wow them with style. And give the very best gifts. Let's holiday. I'm Suzanne Runyon. It's the start of a new day here on the East Coast. Jay King is with me. We're talking about his beautiful mind finds and great gift ideas. And we still, after a spectacular start to our today's special, we still have so many more things to go, including the only turquoise piece we will feature in this show. And it's, of course, the Andrian Blue Nugget Necklace. Now, here's the story on this one. We're talking super, super high grade. Really, I think you'll love this, kind of keeping it real, this sort of very um, authentic look to how 
They've just smoothed out the stones, didn't make a lot of, didn't, didn't fuss with this a lot and really allowed the turquoise to kind of play and have fun with it. To me, this is a great casual piece. It's very easy to wear with all the blue jeans that we love to wear. And we have, of course, five flex pays on it, which is lovely, just like our Today Special. So Jay, let's talk a little bit about it. This actually is the only turquoise piece in the whole hour. It's the only uh, turquoise piece in the uh, hour. This is Andean blue. And like so many things, I mean, we're, we're known for our turquoise. I mean, you know, that, that's actually what Mind Finds is known for. Uh, it was my very first material that I worked with. I grew up in the Southwest. I grew up in New Mexico. Um, so turquoise and I go way, way back. Okay, probably further than I probably should admit to. Okay, <laughs> I mean, you know, but here's the thing with this material. Okay, this is Andean blue. Uh, if you can see, the, look at the clarity of this. The material looking here, and here's the key thing. This is all the natural color. Nothing's been done to this. That's why I always bring the rough material. This, uh, nothing's been done to this, right? It's not been treated. It's not been color enhanced. Um, th we haven't done anything to it. This are the, these are the natural colors. Um, in this case, um, I always try to leave things as natural as possible, and I try to utilize my rough material in the best way possible to not, every time that you shape something, every time you uh, cut anything, anytime you polish anything, you take material away. When you're taking uh, material away, you're also increasing your production cost. You lose 70% of your, of your rough material just on your first cut. I know it sounds crazy. It took me a lot of years to learn that. <laughs> I learned it the hard way. So you learn after a while, let the rough talk to you. Let, you know, let, let, you know, let the material, what, you know, what kind of design can I, can I do, um, do in this? And uh, I came up with this. I kind of, so you've got the natural nuggets polished. We, uh, we did um, the hishi, thick hishi cuts on this, just as an offset. It's a great casual piece. You can wear this time again, anytime, anywhere. Uh, as always, a wonderful value. But the main thing right now, people uh, are dying to buy turquoise rough. I, I can't tell you the number of people that contact me that know that we're sitting on the amount of rough that we're sitting on in these kind of grades. And from these mines, we search the world over. This is Andean blue. This comes from Chile. They mine it at over 12,000 feet. So you think about that. Um, right now too, believe it or not, they're getting ready to go into their mining season because our winter is their spring in South America, right? In the Southern hemisphere. So here in about uh, a month, a little less than a month, is they'll actually start digging again. They'll be able to get into uh, most of the most of the year. In the summer, this is uh, uh, covered with snow, and it's it's all frozen in, so they can't mine it. So they'll actually start. I'm really looking forward um, to the season coming up and being able to get new material. Absolutely, and now we're going to move on to some other material, which is, of course, the green uh, uh, diopside, chrome diopside. Um, it happens to be one of my favorite stones because I always say it looks like it's been plugged in to an outlet, and then it just has this amazing glow to it. So here's a collection we have, and this is actually featured price tonight. And it's all very, very limited. Just want to give you a little heads up, too. We have the necklace that includes the pendant, so that's the first piece. We have the matching earrings, we have the cuff, we have the ring in 5 through 12. The earrings come in right around 1 and 5 sixteenths of an inch and I have three dozen available hardly any the cuff which I think is fantastic there's five cabochons I have 150 of those I literally have a couple hundred of the ring in five through twelve it's just a great nice cabochon and only uh, a few hundred of actually less than 200 of the necklace you know Jay chrome diopside is so beautiful and it really speaks to uh, fashion especially even starting in spring anything that was in an olive green or a Sage or that whole camo story. In fact, one of the big paint companies now has picked for their new color of the year a beautiful version of a green. So it's interesting to see that uh, that the whole green story has been so popular. Yeah, I, I always look at the, the material as far as like the rarity of it. Uh, this is Siberian chrome diopside. You're, the only reason you're seeing this, um, I've got I've got a pile of the rough in front of me right here, 
Okay, that and what I've got in this bag in my turquoise bowl to the side are all the material that I have left. <laughs> okay, and these are, these are gonna go in my specimen case. Um, I'm hoping this is the natural rough. They call this Russian emerald. Of all chrome diopsides, now, you don't find chrome diopside worldwide. Um, our first experience, we, we, uh, we found a deposit in Madagascar. We were really excited about. Um, unfortunately, that uh, it, we got a small amount and then it just couldn't get any more. This is the material, this is a Siberian material. This material is impossible to get in any kind of volume. We were able, just like through so many things, um, through, um, through my connections in the amber industry actually is how I found this connection. And we were able to buy this material. Um, I'm hoping to be able to get more of this rough down the road. Uh, you can buy it, but normally the price of this uh, every item that you're seeing here would be at least double the price, maybe even triple. You can't, that's the whole thing. It's all about grade. This is all natural chrome diopside. This is the best of the best of the best. If you go on and research chrome diopside and see what they sell, even the smallest cabochons in this grade for, I think um, you'd be truly shocked. They're great statement pieces, and these were all created as part of our gallery collection which means they're very limited and there's nothing that you'll ever see again. We don't repeat on them. Okay, so Jay, we're gonna wrap up on that. And again, not only is it non-repeatable, but very limited. I want you guys to give you one more quick peek in case you might've been channel surfing and joined us just a little bit too late. This is our today's special. I just want you guys to see it. Just FYI, this is called the Silver Frost. This is called the Honey. This is Precious Ethiopian Opal. Uh, We're talking five flex pays, 140. Uh, close to 400 have been ordered in just this first hour. We now have less than 2,000 total for the entire rest of the day. That is the smallest little today's special ever. Jay has never done a today's special more limited than this. And look at that fire. Look at how brilliant this is. I just wanted to remind you, if you're thinking about picking up either color, it really doesn't matter. They're both exquisite. I would not wait till later on today. And I know it's, you know, we're heading into, you know, Monday. It's obviously Monday here in the East Coast. And you're thinking, oh, you know, I'll go. I got work to do all day. You're Zooming all day. And you go, oh, you know, I really wanted to get that. That's really an heirloom special treat. Don't wait until later today. At this pace and this rate, we know this will absolutely be an early sellout. Do not expect it to be in tonight's shows with Jay. It just won't possibly be there. So little heads up as we continue on. All right, let's talk rotocrosite. Here we go. This is a beautiful rotocrosite. Cool little story behind this one too. We first featured this one a while back and it sold out in October of last year. Now what's really interesting is you hear Jay say a lot, hey, I can't bring it back. It's very rare. It's tough for me to find. So it's a real treat. Because we'll go to Jay, something will be really successful. We'll say, Jay, we want to bring that back in. And what does Jay do? He literally laughs at us. <laughs> He's like, yeah, tell Mother Nature that. Tell the miners that. Tell the people I have to find around the world to give me more. So, Jay, yeah, you did find more rotocrosite, so I appreciate that. <laughs> well, <clears throat> interesting enough, <laughs> okay, <laughs> on rotocrosite, um, when we showed this the first time, and we did it, and... Um, it's because uh, I bought out uh, an elderly man who specialized in road crocite and lapis, high end, and he did 18 and 22 karat gold. So that, that's the grade of the material. This is the road crocite, and this comes out of a mine out of Argentina, hmm. and this it, it's in a cave, and it's stalactites and stalagmites. That's how they that's how they harvest it. The thing with road now you do find road crocite throughout the world. There's even some. Um, in Silverton, uh, Colorado, there's rhodochrosite at, in, in Silverton. All specimen, I mean, it's rock specimen specimens. I mean, there, there's nothing that's big enough that you can actually manufacture jewelry or manufacture anything with. Um, rhodochrosite, uh, what, what happened with the, with the Argentinian uh, government, look at the grade of this, guys. Is this to die for or what, it's beautiful. right? Yeah. The um, Argentinian government about, I guess around 15 years ago, uh, all of a sudden, sudden that they decided no more ex uh, exporting the rough material. You had to do it in a finished product. Well, the problem is for people like me, I don't have a factory in Argentina and it really wouldn't behoove me to start a factory just so that I can export rhodochrosite. 
So rotocrosite just died, went off the market. You never saw it. It just wasn't around. We uh, went and we were able to first, this necklace, we were able to buy this material from somebody who had had it for probably over 30 or 40 years. No really this high grade. And here again, it's all about grade. This is all A grade material. I mean, this, this material normally you'd see in cabochons, you would see it in gold. You would not see this grade of rotocrosite in a beaded necklace. Um, four years ago, uh, actually, I met some people from Argentina. The Argentinian government, they had gotten permission and this is some of their rough. This was some of the very first rough. It took us a long time to get it to uh, the cutting shop. It took us a long time to process it. But this is, I just, I bring this uh, specimens. This is what it looks like. You can actually see, do you see where it was? Okay, can you imagine this is hanging down? It's either a stalactite or a stalagmite uh, growing from the ground. And then you can see there, and then that's the natural rhodochrosite. Look at the beautiful, and this is the A-grade material. This is what you're looking. Do you see that, like that jemmy-grade material? And I haven't even done anything. All I did to this is I cut it with a bandsaw, and then I just hit it with a leather wheel. I didn't try to polish this even. I mean, this is just the natural colors. I mean, I didn't sit there and buff this to a high gloss, <laughs> okay? <laughs> this is just, this is a specimen just to, what we do is we do color specimens, see what it's gonna look like and, and possibly what it's gonna polish like. Everyone will be uniquely different in their own right. You can see with the Ange, good size. It's a great, great color, natural material. Rotocrite, so very, very rare. Okay, guys, so this is all about stylish gifts, and we're all about a nice little sale right here. In fact, this is clearance, and when I think of nature's most interesting things, it's very difficult to get nature to give us really good, genuine white and black jewelry, and this is the perfect combination of both with a little whisper of gray in there. So here we go. On sale for the very first time, this is now the lowest price we've ever offered. You have this really bold, fantastic calcite feather gray jewelry necklace with the extender on the back. In fact, this comes in at 18 inches. And again, you've got your two and three quarter inch sterling silver extender. We have the matching earrings. They're stud earrings. They were 72. Now they're 49.08. And I'm actually going to pop this one off here. Oh, sorry, Mark. Just because I want you to see it. And I know Angela's putting it on too, but look at how fun this piece is. It's just like having a great black dress, that little, you know, little black dress or that beautiful little white top that you wear with everything. The same is true with this. And it has, Jay, the most amazing feathering effect. I love how nature, like, took, took a pin or a marker and just drew. <laughs> well, you know, this is what uh, kind of what we live for. I, I discovered this, like, uh, so many things so uh, cool. in, in my travels. We're, we're going, we were going to a turquoise mine in Mongolia when we found this and it was on the way uh, and that's how I found the material. I guarantee you there is no feather gray calcite mine in the world, right? Yes. <laughs> this, was, this was one of those small purchases that we I found the rough this. material. Um, I don't know of anybody else that even has this material or has ever even made anything, uh, any jewelry designs or anything, that's how rare it is. Uh, this is a fun stuff that mine find does. Mm. And this is a form of calcite. We call it feather grade just because of the feathering effect, the natural feathering fit of, of how the material, you can see the one Ange is wearing is, is different. They're all the same shape, okay? It's the same design. But if you look at what Suzanne has and what Angie's uh, showing here, do you see every one of them is uniquely different? They're all one of and a kind And it's reversible, pieces. Jay. It's so cool because one side has one crazy pattern and the other side can, looks completely different because it's natural that is well, so it can neat. Be totally what, different wait, what causes that jay i'm fascinated by this one what causes okay, that well, you know that what? scribble look well what it is is if um okay if you, it's actually crystals growing through like you know they're not these aren't really what they are aren't dendritic right but it's where the material has fractured that one time so this started off as calcite started off as a sedimentary deposit um, and then um, there was some kind of seismic activity, right? So it created the, the cracks and then it metamorphosized over millions of years of heat and pressure. So whatever, like in this, I, I would assume, and I, you know, here again, I would just from years of doing this, I would say this is probably some kind of form of iron oxide 
that that is this that or it's magnesium, one of the two. And what's happened is it's filled those cracks, and that's what you got. And then it all became solid again. It metamorphosized, uh, you know, pressurized back together, so it's a solid piece. There's no cracks, so but cool. that's what causes the feathering. This. You know, it's it's so funny, Jay. Well, you know what? You know that I do. I think there's something so um, very eclectic about this. Um, you know, the, the, if you're like me, you when if you if you tune in to watch Jay King, you're the type of person who wants something really unusual. It's funny. My brother Chip, he watches a lot with his partner Troy, and he's like, he even says, he goes, "Oh my gosh, Jay's jewelry is so unique." We just had a full conversation on the phone the other night about Jay, and he's like, "It is just so beautiful." So if if you're looking at this and you like something that's eclectic, I do. When I go out with my girlfriends, I do not want to be caught dead with the same outfit, the same jewelry that they all bought at the same mall. I and they and people expect that of me, obviously because of the job I do. But I really take great pride, like you do, in wearing the unusual. This really resonates with me. I love the fact that it's very easy to wear. This will work with a great white blouse or a great T-shirt, or think of a black turtleneck you're wearing this winter, and you've got got on high shaft boot and a cute little black skirt with it and maybe you're wearing some of those really cute pattern tights you'll look adorable and then you turn around and say you know what I can wear this gray I can wear it with pink I can wear it with reds if I want to it's just like buying the perfect little black top or white top you can wear it with everything but if you're like me this really resonates for me because it has this eclecticness to it again where have you ever seen this have you ever gone to a mall store which is so blah and the same old, same old on both ends of the mall. If you've ever, ever seen anything like this, I hope you picked it up, but I bet you haven't. And here's your time to get it. Guys, this is on sale. Take advantage of it. We have a limited quantity, $42 off on the necklace. I think we've taken 49, uh, 20 some dollars off the earrings. And then of course it's available, but that is a really, really super uh, low price, which I think is exceptional for a really great look. I'm kind of totally loving that one. All right. So this is one of my favorites in the show, and it's because there's kind of a cool story behind it. Number one, it's purple. Purple is my personal favorite color in the whole wide world. <laughs> I love purple. So immediately I was attracted to this. There was two things I was very attracted to in the show. Number one, by far the Today Special. That is just mind blowing. It's the most magnificent opal that we've ever had on the air, and I've been doing this for a long time. It's the most magnificent opals that I've ever seen. It's just unbelievable. I'm so tickled to get to wear it. But this is one of the other ones that caught my eye because again, it's purple, it's big, and it's bold. I think if you watch Jay, we really love the bold jewelry. You know, like I said, if you're a Jay King fan, if you're a collector, I know there's so many of you who collect his pieces, this resonates with you as well. So we are talking about Lapidolite, and this is almost $30 off. Now, this is amazing. This is actually a reorder, and we have it on sale tonight. So you're getting our best price. I have 300 for the entire day. It is a bib design, and you're going to see it on Angie in just a second, you'll see it fits perfectly on the neckline. My, this is not the normal shape of our necks. This is gonna lay just perfect when you wear it. So I want you to know that if you're picking it up. Also, we have five flex pays on everything in our show from Jay. So again, you're gonna spread your payments out over five months, use a major credit card. It's $34.78 to get a real show piece. This sold out a year and a half ago with Jay and I. So again, I was really excited to see it back because I was like, oh, there it is, the Lapidolite little pit of light piece. Jay, I really love that you went for it on this one. Well, it's Cleopatra design. You and I, we launched this yeah. and they blew out like in seconds. So fast. I mean, it, 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 <laughs> didn't, it didn't even make the time that they had on it. It sold out. They ask us, can you, you know, the, the main thing, I, it's not that I do it to be mean because I'm not. It's normally I can't do it, right? Um, it took us over a year to be able to bring this back. As you can see, we don't have thousands, guys, no. okay? This is a very, now, that being said, I want everybody to know, not all lapidolite is created equal, okay? And um, I could show you what normal lapidolite looks like, and you would go, ick, you know? <laughs> no way, I'm gonna make that into jewelry. Uh, so this is just the grade of the material. This comes, I, I get lapidolite in this grade, from two locations. There's a, a miner I know in Australia, which every now and then he'll give me a call and I can get some more rough material. This actually comes from South Africa. It comes really, it's not that far from where the Kimberly Diamond Mine 
Ivis. <laughs> the the no center kidding. cone that is the Kimberly Diamond Mine, that, that, it's not mined very far from that, is, is if you want to know the location. Uh, if you look at this material, very clean, it's all natural. We have not done anything to this at all. This is mother nature other than faceted. The color consistency is phenomenal. When you, when you see this necklace, I did this in a Cleopatra style, and you would think that because it's so large, and when you see it on Ange, look at the size of this, okay? This is one of those pieces, I guarantee you, if you're a person who likes to have conversation pieces, if you like to be seen, if you like, I mean, I, I think that there's a reason why you accessorize, is you have, I, I know that I have things that I, well, I wear them because I love them, but I, I always love the fact when people come up and they grab my wrist, or they'll grab something I have and they'll go, that is phenomenal. I, you know, um, that's amazing. You know, what, what is that? And this is what you're gonna get in this. Okay, this is lipidolite, but look at the presence of it. Unbelievably or not, this is the design, and it took us a long time because they're hand done. This is very flexible, believe it or not. When you put it on your neck, it's not going to be like this horse collar that, that is just going to weigh you down. It right. actually forms and fits to your collarbone. As you can see here with Ange, do you see how lovely that lays? It's just amazing, yeah, amazing you know craftsmanship. You know what, Jay, I'm gonna do so you guys can see that again, because I do, again, this is on its way to selling out. We don't have many, but see, look at that. See how it just drapes beautifully? So don't worry, if you think this is gonna be poking up, he's built it so Do you see how flexible that is? See how flexible that is? So don't worry, it's gonna lay on your neck really, really, really nicely. Okay, so now we're gonna move on to Tiger's Eye. And I really like, kind of like talking about Tiger's Eye, especially this time of year, because I don't know about you, but the temperature here in Florida finally got to where it was cool today, and I whipped out and wore a pair of boots today. <laughs> I was so excited I could put them on. One of my favorite times of the year, I love the fall. I think it's renewal for me. You know, maybe people the spring. For me, it's fall. I love all the fall colors. I especially love the fall clothing. Putting on the jeans, you know, after a hot, long summer. Wearing the chunky sweaters. Wearing the great brown boots. And I think Tiger's Eye is absolutely sincere sensational jewelry when it comes to fall. Tiger's Eye is great too in the summer because of all the khakis and the taupe colors we wear. If you buy a lot of the colors from uh, Marla Wynn's collection, she always has a lot of beautiful taupes and creams, but it's great because it's such an awesome transitional color for fall. And also I love Tiger's Eye back to jeans. So if you wear a lot of blue jeans, and I'll throw it up here so you guys can see it, I think Tiger's Eye looks amazing because of the contrast. So if you love your indigos and your chambrays and your mid-tones, then you're going to really enjoy having some tiger's eye in your collection. And Jay, I really love, this very much looks like a gallery design because of the way you decided to facet and to shape these stones. I think the shape is really fascinating. Well, this is, okay, it's part of the gallery collection. And if you look at this, and this is what, what we're all about in Mind Finds, um, this, that's the natural tiger's eye rough. This comes from Namibia. Uh, it has one of the rare properties in Mother Nature it's called chatoyancy, and that's what you're seeing. And that's a crystalline structure growing within the host uh, material, and that's that's what you're seeing. You're seeing that light refraction. You're seeing those crystals. That's what makes it uh, shine and glow. What makes the design so unique and so different? They're all we we all started off. We don't buy designs from anybody. We don't. I mean, we manufacture everything. Um, we. You know, we create everything in-house. These are all really one-of-a-kind designs. When, when we do these designs, uh, we, we all started out making for uh, one-of-a-kind, uh, my British wife calls them one-offs. We used to, used to make one-of-a-kind pieces, and then I would sell to a jewelry store, to bridge jewelry stores, to galleries, to fashion boutiques. That, that was my, my business. And our other designers, the same, same thing. So we're still giving you that kind of what we're able to do, how we started out, where we're giving you one of a kind designs, but we're able, because of what we're allowed to do here uh, on the network, we're able 
to uh, bump it up a notch. Okay, so we are going to wrap up our hour in a very, very big way. And I wanna say lapis, 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 lapis. <laughs> lapis is literally, we can't keep it in stock. Jay is always on the search for it. It comes out of Afghanistan, so you can imagine the issues now trying to get a hold of some lapis. So for those of you who've been searching for lapis, you love lapis, maybe you wanna add it to your collection. Now Jay's gone really long with it. I actually have three choices, and this is spinel combined with either your classic beautiful blue blue lapis or orange chalcedony or you can do the third choice which is your malachite so here's the malachite here's the lapis and then here's the orange chalcedony and jay did 60 big inches the great thing about it is you guys asked for it yep there's a clasp on the back so you can really have fun with this you can belt it if you want you can use it tripled around your neckline but the best price is originally this was 115.25 and again for lapis and these great gemstones awesome awesome price tonight while i have a couple remaining because this is very, very limited, as we have a lot of our stuff is. We are now down to 89.43 with five plex pays on top of that. So, Jay, I got to get into this lapis story right off the bat because, one, I was thrilled to see lapis. I have not had lapis with you in a very, very long time. So, yay, lapis is here. Uh, and I really love how you designed this one. I think these turned out great. Well, we do these by request. Um, we get... You know, we uh, as a standard link, this is the longest necklace that we do. We do 60 inches. What I love about these, uh, number one, uh, all three of the materials are very unique, uh, very unusual. The thing with 60 inches, you, you're making one purchase, okay? One purchase. You're getting, think about this. So you're getting five feet, five feet of material. The In this case, we've, uh, between the natural nuggets and all, three different materials. We've got the orange chalcedony from uh, the Republic of Congo. You've got the lapis from the Hindu Kush region of Afghanistan. And you've got the malachite, which also comes from the Republic of Congo. All three of these materials are um, very limited. You don't find them out on the commercial market. With lapis, it's all but disappeared in this grade. I mean, we're uh, next year, uh, there won't be a lot of beads at all in lapis. I mean, I'm still gonna have lapis in my designs, but you just aren't gonna see beads. I, I just don't have the material uh, to be able to do it. What, this is actually, I wish I could go back to this day. No I wish, kidding. I, wish, I could be, be teletransported back. This is uh, from directly from my buyer. This is where we, uh, we used to go. We used to buy, hand pick. This is all the material that is not available anymore. This is all the A grade material. You just don't see it on the market. It's all denim lapis, it's all low grade, it's just a lot of junk. That's all A grade lapis right there too, that's a specimen. Um, but here's the thing, 60 inches, uh, I always joke, especially if I had Lynn here, um, it's taller than Lynn. <laughs> okay, so <laughs> think about this. Your necklace would be taller than Lenny Bobeni, okay? <laughs> so, uh, which I think is amazing. But you make that one buy and think of all the different ways you can wear this. Right. I mean, there are so many. We, we had a contest one day uh, with this, and I came up with, I think, 24 or 26 different ways uh, to wear it. Somebody else came up with more, but they cheated. They used an enhancer, right? And they started using things. <laughs> oh, I'm that's talking, a good idea, actually. Uh, I, I'm talking just, I was just playing with it with the different ways you can wear it. Now, in this case, because of the black spinel, you get, you see that sparkle? You get I, that bling? It dresses but also, it up. The reason we did it, though, they act as pivot points. Spinel is very, very, very hard. It. It's a form okay. of hematite. So it's very, very hard. It facets beautifully. But it also, between the lapis nuggets, the chalcedony, uh, um, uh, chalcedony uh, nuggets and the malachite uh, nuggets, it acts as a pivot point. So it even makes it more flexible. You could actually take this and roll it up into your hand. That's how flexible it is. So you make one buy, but you get over 20 different ways to wear it, 20, 
you know, over 20 different ways that you could actually accessorize. Oh, I love that. You've got, um, 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 we've shown the, the, and yeah. just doubled it up and, doubled, and twisted, and twisted it. it. Yeah. But so even think that just that now taking it That's and, the and it. Yeah, that's right. and you could even do it another time around if you want to make it even tighter. And then you could wear it as a bracelet. Can you know, you know how cool it would be to wrap it around your wrist multiple times and wear it as a big chunky kind of bracelet look? Um, okay, here's a little heads up. If you want the lapis, that's now the most limited. Just a little 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 word of warning. Um, and again, this is really one of those rare moments where if you would love to get lapis, maybe you have a big chunky nugget necklace and you want to do more layering with your other lapis pieces. Jay's done lapis with uh, turquoise that and using those together with this really is a finishing statement look. I love it because it's nice and long. I mean, you really can. We have a lot of tops, like I'm wearing an Amon top I bought a couple weeks ago, and I love it because it really can fill that elongated space. I wanted to remind you guys real quick, and we're gonna talk more about this in just one second, but I wanted everybody to get one more clap, really close up look at our today's special. This is genuine, 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 precious Ethiopian opal. You have the honey, or you have what's called the silver frost. They are neck and neck. We've sold about four or 500 in just this hour alone. I only brought in, and we only had 2,400 for the entire day. We are now well less than 2,000 for all day long, so this is not gonna be around. It is the finest, the finest, the finest that Jay's done. It's the most excited uh, I've ever seen him about any of the pieces that he's brought us. And he will tell you flat out, it's one and done. This is a once in a lifetime deal he got. He was sitting on it for four years. We launched it in this hour, and I just wanted to give you one really nice close look because that is unprecedented quality. It's like a ton of million little rainbows just sparkling on fire and that's what you want. The more color the opal is, the more valuable, the more rare and the more expensive it is. With five flex on it, just another really quick last look before I have to wrap this hour up. I just wanted to make sure if you missed the first part of the show you obviously can watch next hour. You'll see a repeat of it and learn all about it but if you want to get it now, it's the perfect time to order yours. Again, they will sell out early today. They will not make it in tonight's show at this point, unfortunately. I'm sorry, Allison, what'd you say? Oh, speaking of sellout. Okay, guys, just here's an update on this, the lapis. We're down to the final couple hundred in the 60-inch lapis. And look at 60 inches. It is, look at that. It's like really, really tall. Yeah, Jay, why is the lapis so special? And why is it so difficult to find? Well, it, it started about five years ago. Uh, where we saw, you know, I, could, I, I don't have enough time to explain why it's happening, but I'm just telling you it is happening. It's a reality. Nobody has. Is it, I could take you to yards where there's 50, 100,000 tons of lapis, right? You see this right here? There's none of that there. Zero. You, it's all been picked through. All of this grade of material is gone, and this is the grade of material that we use. We're, you know, we, we hoard stuff. We put stuff back. Um, the materials I'm using... And a lot, of, uh, a lot of this material, even in this design, can be from material that I've had for over 20 years, 25 years. It's just not available anymore. We're not getting anymore. Um, it's just, it's dried up. I started seeing it five years ago, started drying up. About three years ago is when it just kind of all shut down. And then the last two years, forget it. I mean, it is, is zero. There's nobody that even has it on the commercial market. I mean, guys that, that I could go to, that have, you know, that, that do, you know, collect certain things, they don't even have the rough. Even if I'm willing to pay some stupid, ridiculous price, right? <laughs> they don't have it to sell. No, it's didn't. just not there. Um, you'll eventually see, you know, what you're gonna see in lapis and beads, I guarantee is this, I'm already seeing it to be honest with you, is they're taking low grade denim material and they're color enhancing it, they're treating it, and they're getting that nice blue. But it's not, this is all natural, everything that we're selling. This is very interesting, and I love it on Ange. Do you see, and you know what I love about Ange? Is she, she's plays with it, right? She has fun with it. Do you see, she's doing simple designs, but just, do you see, she's done three different looks now, okay? So every time that you see Ange, she's done a different look. She, see how you can gra graduate, you can play with this. Uh, it's literally so fun, and this is Congolian malachite. Of all the malachite in planet Earth, this is the finest quality. All right, Jay, so we're going to say goodbye for now. Um, and Jay will be back with oh, Lynn yeah. coming up at 11 a.m. Thank you for a beautiful show and an amazing today special. Thank you. Don't, don't miss out on these opal, guys. Yeah. You'll regret it. You <laughs> will regret it. 
Yeah, and then uh, when Jay's back at 11, they will have a big update for you, I am sure, coming up in that 11 o'clock show. Hey, don't forget to type jewelry gifts in our hsn.com search engine uh, because you can find a whole host of amazing jewelry gifts. You know, everything from diamonds to Jay's beautiful opals to, I love it, Connie Craig Carroll. She's a former host here at HSN. There's more of Jay's beautiful turquoise. We've got silver, we've got gold, we've got fashion jewelry, and certainly great, and that is that today's special, guys. It will be a customer pick. Absolutely the most brilliant opal we have ever offered. Two great choices. And again, if you want to use the Flex, we've got five Flex on it. You can spread your payments out over five months and you truly get a once in a lifetime piece. It is something that I think you are going to be just in love with. The minute you open the box, your eyes are gonna pop and you'll be like, wow, I really can't believe I got this. And it really is such a special offer. All right, so you're gonna learn more about that in just a second. Hey, rejoin me. I'm gonna be here on Tuesday night. I have at 7 p.m., Suzanne Gets Crafty, 8 p.m., fantastic football NFL goodies with me. And then at 9.30, I go live on Facebook with a creative show as well. So I'll see you back on Tuesday evening.